Actually, now that I came up here for the tour, but now looking at it, there's more of this tower. Oh, no, I'm sorry. This is the guard tower. This is where we left off. Right. I remember now. Okay. So what I wanted to do is figure out these and how far they'll go. I think we're going to go all the way around um, because most of this is going to be visible from down there anyway in the harbor. Um, I think it makes sense for it to have all the battlements and stuff. So let's let's look at our inventory. We have some stuff on us, but we're going to need uh, some more cobblestone to get our stuff going. So I think we should have some around in here, maybe. We have regular stuff. We have cobblestone up in the back right. Okay, so here's some more. That might be enough for what we need. Um, I guess I could always break some regular smooth stone. Okay, we'll go with this for now. So we're going to move, there's stairs on the outside here, we're going to move the, that on the inside, but I'm going to wait to put those in until we have the battlements, just so I have an idea of, oh, okay, note to self, very strong pick. Okay, so let's see if we can do the pattern right. Um, so in the, potentially we'll have this in the back, so we'll see how it all lines up. Um, but so going around this way, this would be a drain. And if we come this way, this is a drain. Do we have... We don't have the right materials for that. Do we have... We don't have any wood. Oh, we do. We, we, have, we have enough wood. Okay. Crafting bench. Because um, we're going to need some stairs. Uh, let's make a bunch of them just so that we... Because we're going to lose... Some stuff. Okay, so I'll put in the drains there and there, and then for now, just so we, I guess I got to use those stairs for this. Oh, whatever. Um, so coming out this way, then we'll have this right. Oh, I see. This should be also a drain. Okay. So boop, and then here we're going to go with um, a block. Block, stair, stair. This is where it's going to be open. So then going around the back here, we're going to go stair, um, turn. So stair again. But it should be... No, that, that didn't quite work, actually. Maybe we need this one as well. I want it to be a curved one. So I guess we'll aim for the top. And then I think that might work. I think that works. Okay. And then so from here... Um, so we actually don't have any drains on the front of... The, oh, no, we do have some here. So they're lined up for here. Let's see if that makes sense for, for this. So this would potentially be a drain and then one here. Maybe. So if we did that, then this would be a drain. Um, and then... Oh, I see, because this thing is... It's a different shape in the front, so we actually don't need to follow it exactly, probably. Um, and these are separated by... These are three apart, though. But we'll see if we can adjust it. So if this is a drain here. Um, we potentially could have one here. Let's count that out. So two in from there. Then if we go three over, and then three over... So that would be pretty darn close. So actually, is it an odd number? It is, isn't it? Interesting. All right, so then I guess we should plan instead to have um, okay. Um, so we're gonna have one in the middle, and then we'll go three over. So one, two, three. And then we'll see how that all comes together. So this would be the drain. This would be the drain here, where this thing is. One, two, three, drain. Okay, so then let's build out this. So here, this would be a block. Block here, and a block there. Probably, I guess. Yeah. And then we'll go, so stairs. Oops. So 
stairs. And I guess this is a block. We'll see how this looks from the other, from the other side. We can adjust how this part works. So this would be a slab. So we don't have any of those right now. Let's get our cobblestone slabs going. Um, is there room in this to th throw things in there? Sorta. Of. Enough. Enough room. Okay. So let's move that out. So slabs here. This is the places where you can stand. And then otherwise we're going to have um, these guys going across there. And I guess that's all closed up. We'll see if we want to change those corners or not. But for now. And then here, we should actually finish this out. So this would be stair, uh, corner stair. Put these guys in like that. Okay. And then um, we want to put in stairs going some direction. We'll have to think about. So here, um, I want this to be accessible, I think. Maybe not. I guess we might go like that. Because if we have this blocked off, that might actually make this seem like a better corner. And then over here, we can do the same thing. Block behind there and a block behind that one. And here, okay. So then here there isn't one, so we will put in this one and then this direction. And then the middle part here, it's in the middle. So it gets a little weird. Um, so I think we might go, oh no, that covers it up entirely. All right. Um, we could go like that. So this is the new type of design, but that might work. Okay. We're going to need a lot more um, stairs in a second. So let's get some more stairs going. Need some more cobblestone. Uh, silk touch fortune. dig out the floor. Okay. Let's see if that's enough. So what we'll do, we're going to have uh, fences on top of the stairs. And then here, this is a new design. So I have to kind of think about how I want to do this. Uh, nope, this is only, this server is actually only for my patrons and, um, and myself. So usually, actually, we'd have... I need more cobblestone. It's a private server. Let's make some more cobblestone. Oh, dear. Let's write that. Okay, um, so cobblestone will be there. Now it's kind of cramped then. So we might consider not doing this. And then put this on top. Um, unless we make this be a longer opening. So we could still do stairs here. So we'll change this out to be a slab. I think we actually have some of those. Yeah, some of those slabs. Actually, that might be enough. Just do that and then do this. There we go. Now it's an opening. Okay, cool. Put this on top. That's on top. On top. On top. And we want a block here. Um, oh, you can't hear me? Oh, sorry. Um, yeah, no, uh, this is only for my patrons, so... Um, so it's a private server. Can't join, sorry. Do, 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 do. 
So we'll put torches on top of these. And then we'll add in the stairs. So how do we usually do this? We have this. And then we'll go um, like that. So it curves in like that. And then we'll go over here. So this, we'll have to see. So I want to curve in there. This one's a little bit longer than normal. I guess we'll put a block here. So I'll end up connecting. Uh, let's see how that looks. And then we'll curve this in. Oh, it didn't work. So that it curves. There we go. And then over here. There we go. Curves in. This one we already have in place. Now uh, we'll start here. Make our way over. Oops. Right here. So it curves. And then here we'll do the same thing we did over there. So a block here. This comes up, works its way around, and then it's going to curve in like that. And then over here, curves in. Nope. There you go. Curves in. Yeah, there you go. Okay. So there we go. So that is uh, this. I still need to add the other other spots. Welcome, Purple Crafted. See if that's enough. Um, okay, so now that we have this in place, we need to have the stairs put in. So we need to think about, I mean, I could just do a ladder, but I was thinking about having stairs. So things are going pretty well today. I, um, I have been uh, working on the battlements on top of this. Um, trying to decide the used to, the stairs used to be on the outside of this but then I added the battlements in so now they're going to be on the inside I guess they don't need stairs actually now I think about it because I already have a ladder right here <laughs> okay great solved problem solved okay so we can get rid of these and then what we'll do is where these are here we'll add in the supports so I add a little bit of extra you know something going on and then over this direction put one in here so it's a little bit cramped here I guess but I'm okay with that Okay, cool. Comes around this way. Put one here. Oop, okay. I thought we might run out. Do I have any? No. Okay. Oop. Let's make some more. Do, 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 do. And then. I already had this one. Good. Okay. Cool. So now we have that in place. What I want to do is look to see how does that look from different angles. So I think it looks pretty good from here. What about from over this way? So it looks a little crazy with these, sort of. I think that looks okay. Um, what I want to do is check. Let's grab some ender pearls. Oh, now I can't jump over this as easily. There we go. Oh, and this. No, this is fine. Put this up there. Thank you for the follow. Uh, cut. Duke. Welcome. Uh, dog barking in the background. Sorry. Uh, so we have some ender pearls now to check out some different points of view of the things we just put in. So that looks pretty good from here. Um, I mean, that side looks a little bit extra chunky. Um. But I think it's okay. I could cut out possibly, I guess the um, the corner, but I think that's so that's okay. Let me look at it from um, a different angle. So let's go out the front door. We'll look at it from. Oh, it's gonna go too far. Okay, that's not too bad. So there's the. I guess here you can only really see the front anyway. So that looks pretty good. And you can't. I think there's a, the other layer was on top of that. No, I guess that's the top. Have you ever gotten tired of doing this? Um, I have taken a break from this castle. Um, I took a break. Um, 
Well, actually, I've taken a break from both Minecraft uh, at times um, and also this particular project on the server. So I have another project, which is a big iron farm um, that I was working on, working on there, uh, doing all kinds of crazy stuff. Um, and so that project um, was a big tangent that took you know many months to to, to work on. And I said it gave me a chance to try out different ideas and, and do sort of a different building style as opposed to a more castle. Um, so let's see, what is what? So this might, I mean, we're not going to be here very often, but uh, what design for the iron? Yeah, so the the iron farm, I mean, it was actually functionally, it's sort of the dock M, um, you know, where they're, they're spaced apart and there's water channels that run in and stuff. But then in terms of the actual build itself, I'll show you that in a second, actually. Um, it was a bit different. So yeah, so I guess we don't really have, I should put another window right there. I wonder why I didn't. Maybe we should do that while we're thinking about it. Can I get in over there? I mean, I'm not gonna be able to get in there with this throw. But can we? Can we sneak our way into one of the windows? Yes. Okay. What floor is missing a window? Next floor. No. Next floor. Aha. That's why. Interesting. So that's here. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, well, well, we'll put in the window. <laughs> and then I'll, I'll, just so I remember I have to put one in, and then I'll change these walls to make that work. Uh, okay, anyway, so uh, it looks like it looks pretty good. Um, so that is, that's the thing we just made. Um, now, actually, let's take a break. And let's run over to the uh, iron farm. And I'll show you what that looks like. It's a pretty cool build. Give us a little, little mini tangent while we can run over there. Um, so that one is like I started out as a, it was an iron farm. So it's a it's a quad um, iron farm um, underneath the ocean, um, mainly so that it wouldn't be a, an eyesore. Um, and then I decided I wanted to build some other farms into it, so I started digging out the space. And then I just kept on digging, and then I had a bunch of extra stuff. Welcome, neutral, neutral snake, eighty two. Welcome. So pop into the iron farm. So this uh, this thing here is the top of the iron farm. Let's go out here so we can see a little better. Um, so this is you know, where you come in, and then there's um, there's actually an item elevator that goes through the middle here, and goes up into the water stream, and then comes down, and then goes into all these are all chests inside the water, with sorting system behind them. All, going all the way around the whole ring. Um, well, thank you. Um, thank you for the follow, uh, Yoda boss. Yoda boss. Yoda boss. Uh, it's a lighting glitch there. That's weird. Um, so this is the iron farm. So okay, there we go. Perfect example. So this, these plat. Actually, that that only that platform. There are four other ones, but it's just so symmetrical. Um, they are uh, sort of not great iron farms, or uh, rather slime farms. So he'll eventually maybe fall into the hole, or he'll hang on the edge. <laughs> but in theory, he, he may eventually fall into the magma blocks. Thank you for the follow uh, inside Xbox. Um, no, I don't. Oh, he's gonna fall. He's gonna fall in. I get a demo. Another one spawned. That's cool. Flying microbe. Welcome to the stream. They fall into the hole. I want. I want to demo how it works. Well, there's a lot of them spawning. Eventually, one of them will fall in, and then I'll show you that it works. This is why I'm saying is this thing is they they sort of naturally go in there, um, but um, but they don't always. Partly it's because I, I the way I built in the walls to make them look nicer. There's a little bit of a lip, so they end up sort of catching on the edge. But in theory. Any, any day now. Oh, that one might fall in. Okay, so they fall in. They'll die. They fall into the, the four ones. They die, and there's hopper mine carts underneath. So it collects all the stuff. It gets sent down into this chamber, down to the very bottom, runs along the middle, up the item elevator, and then we can watch it shortly coming up the item elevator.
and he didn't know. <laughs> it's a little, it has a little bit, a little bit of, a, uh, of a distance to travel to get there. But it'll, pretty soon, it'll go. There it goes. I, there's, the, there's the slime balls. <laughs> so they go up. Welcome, do, do Stampy. Welcome. So that they go up, they go down, and then they go around this whole thing, and then so wherever wherever the slime blocks actually or the slime balls actually go, they get stored. Okay, so there's that. So that's a slime farm on top of that. We'll work our way down. And as we go through, we can see like this sort of gives you a hint of where things are. So dirt it gets sorted out to here. So if we look in, actually this is Do we not have very much dirt? Where's all my dirt? Oh, okay. I guess for some reason they're not in those zones. But anyway, so it gets sorted out into these different spots. I wonder why this one isn't doesn't have any dirt. That's weird. Hmm. Okay, anyway. Um, so then, uh, but you're inside the water here, just to be different. <laughs> so this is where they're all sorted in, all the stuff. So this is probably iron in here, maybe? No. That's one problem. Yeah, here's the iron where they get sorted in. Um, so with 1.12, 1.13... I'll probably be able to put in signs and then waterlog the signs so that there's actually labels here, but it doesn't like disturb the water. Um, so that'd be cool. Um, all right, let's go ahead and show the rest. So then, as we head down, this is the the slime blocks. One of these ones is actually a slime farm, uh, but only one of them because it happens to be in a slime chunk. Uh, otherwise, this big box is a mob farm. Um, so they will spawn in there um, naturally. So there's an example of one. So they spawn in there, and then they end up walking off the edge into the water. It's kind of an etho design, I think. Um, they fall down onto there and die, usually. And then the items move in to the middle. There's an example of an uh, iron golem that just died. Um, so they, there's in the, in the corners, inside the walls, there's iron golem farms. So then they work their way down through there, fall into the lava, and die. And all those things get collected, sent up here, and sorted out. And then we also have Ender uh, Nether Travel. Um, so we have some hoppers going through the nether that spit out into this portal here um, to collect stuff into those chests. So I don't think we have actually hooked up to anything right now, but we could. We could have like some other farm, like a you know a, a string farm or something that sends over string uh, over to this base, but we don't right now. Uh, that was something I just sort of added in for fun just to see if it would work. Um, but yeah, so that is the, the build here. Uh, witches don't always die, um, and then also if they spawn with feather falling boots, they don't always die. But for the most part, everything falls and dies. Works pretty well. Um, but this was uh, I didn't I didn't dig all of this out, uh, and actually also John helped out with some of the chests going around the outside or a bunch of the chests. Um, but otherwise, I did a bunch of the different building stuff, um, and then I had JJ Bonzig and some other people help me out with a bunch of the excavating. And then, so it's this big, we're in the middle of an ocean. Um, so it's this huge opening. So here's a closer view of them dying. And then they die. Ta-da. And then they dropped, they dropped slime balls, but um, it happened so quick that it doesn't really show. It absorbs them in. So that is the iron, or the iron farm slash, you know, all kinds of other farms. <laughs> It's not the safest place because you could potentially drop here all the way down to bedrock but it's fun and it also could drown if you don't have uh so th there's the, the tops of the this gives the air air pockets or uh yeah i guess like the access to the sky for the the actual village in each of the the air environs in those four spots what is oh i see and this is actually where the water, where the items come down. So if you watch, are they not going to come now? There we go. So there's a bunch of items that are coming from the farm stuff, working its way up, and then they, they go over the water here, and then they shoot down really through here, here really fast, go into the hoppers there, and then work their way through the whole sorting, going all the way around the whole ring. That's fun. Fun little side project. <laughs> uh, while I was working, well, I was taking a break from building the village and the castle and everything. Yeah, thank you. That's fun. Um, okay, so back this way. We'll head back to uh, Baskatopia. 
I think I have a, a map somewhere. Probably my ender chest, I guess. Um, so Vascotopia, I mean, you saw like a couple buildings and then a castle. Um, I have to answer that in a second. I forgot to close that program. Uh, we are... It's almost day. Okay. So this actually gives us a, a point of view of the uh, of the sky. Um, Alright, actually, oh, I know what I could do. I could add in the, the windows into the back tower. I think that that might be a good thing to do. Yeah. Lots of sea lanterns. And so that actually, that thing there is not a... Um, uh, it's not a farm itself, not a uh, like a sea monument farm, ocean monument farm. Um, that one is, a, there's a different base that John put together uh, for the ocean monument farm. And then I took, you know, I skipped on getting supplies of all kinds of stuff. Welcome, thank you for the follow, uh, uh, Jocelyn? Jol, Jolson? Jolson? Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. Um, okay, we want to get back this way get up to where we have all of our um sugar boxes and we want to get our supplies to make some windows so let's see what we have so we want to get a bunch of those we need to make more uh, we don't need our birch with us right now nor the battlement stuff let's make some more of these. I don't know how many we'll need. Oh, we'll use them. oh, no, actually, I guess I needed some still. Okay, that's fine. We can make some more. So we don't need... We do, already do have quite a few slabs. And otherwise, we need a bunch of stairs. So we'll see how much... What that gives us. We can also grab just some extra uh, smooth stone. In case we need some more. Okay. So now work on the towers over here really hate making crack yeah yeah i wish there was an easier way than having to cook it but somewhere i do have i mean i have like a, an array of uh, furnaces and we have a it's not exactly a um like a blaze farm but pretty close so i have a window there i don't have a window here i think i probably want one no i decided not to because it was right there okay so we're going to have a window here. Um, so a window overlooking here. This is going to eventually be a kitchen for the, the banquet hall up above. So we'll put in these windows. And then it's possible we may have to end a little bit earlier than I planned just to resolve that work stuff. Um, so this one, I might be able to get away with... I mean, it's not... It's not as perfect, but it's a little bit weird here. We could potentially do this. Let me see. So I could still have a door here. I'll leave it like this, and then we'll see what having a door here is like. Otherwise, I can actually push this wall over by one. Uh, Catbot didn't like that. I wonder why Catbot didn't like that message. Uh, let me figure out how I can un catbot that one. Restore. There we go. Okay. <laughs> um, and I just have four furnaces on top of another four furnaces. Um, so eight furnaces and just placed. Yeah, right. Oh, I see. Yeah, so they cook. Okay, I gotcha. Makes sense. Um... Okay, so yeah, we might move this. You made it, JJ Bonzig! We were at the SOS for hours. Yeah, so uh, you can do a lot of that online, maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. Uh, welcome, and thank you for the follow, Gary uh, uh, Winthrow, Winthrop. Winthor, Winthorp. Um, yeah, uh, let's see. Uh, not your first transfer into the state. Uh, I see. You see me? Are, are we? Is it like Avatar? I see you. I don't know, if, you if you haven't watched Avatar, you don't know what I'm talking about. But it's a, it's a good movie. Fun time. Good movie. The um, we uh we had trivia last night, 
it went really well. Um, so this is a, the wall that's against um, that has the the other like the mountain side there. So we don't have one on that side. Uh, this goes here. Uh, what's your question? Uh, nope, nope. Don't advertise yourself. It's not a, not a very good etiquette for when you're attending streams. Um, even if you, even though you said please, <laughs> it's still not proper. Okay. So this is a secret door area. We'll we'll leave that open just so we can remember it's there. Um, do we, why did we decide no window here? Hmm. I think we put in a window. So we'll go like that. Cool. And then we'll eventually put in like rooms and stuff and through her through here. And over here. Uh, and I guess here, because of where the stairs are, we might not do it. Make some more stairs shortly, so we don't have any there. Next layer, next layer down. So here is where we stopped the windows. So we actually don't necessarily need any more. Oh, look at all the smooth stone. How nice. Um, let's so let's take a look outside and see if we should probably add in more or not. Um, I can't quite get a good angle. Is there a creeper over here? What did I say? Oh, it was a cop. Okay. Um, no, I think that's a good spot to stop. And then there's one missing there. That I feel like... Oh, right. I have a zombie villager and a regular villager trapped in there. Um, so we can do this to get a little bit higher. And then... I think that'll work. Yeah, good, awesome, okay. Uh, so we have one there, we have one there. No, I, s oh, it, it's actually on the side of the thing. So we have, we have one there, we have one there. We have one there. Where did it, where am I? Oh no, right here, this is what I want. Uh, so it gets a little bit complicated because of the stairs, but actually I think we're okay. Uh, and I don't have... I'm short. Oh, crafting bench, yes. The advantage of having crafting benches everywhere is that then they're everywhere. You can just access them wherever you want. Okay, there we go. Now I have a window. This thing is still... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move this wall. Um, so let's get our axe on our bar. The block sounds are lined up today. Awesome. I didn't even restart or anything. <laughs> I was going to and then forgot. Um, so I'm glad that it resolved itself. I blame Mixer. I, I didn't check the VOD to find out if uh, if it was an issue on the VOD. Like on my local VOD or not. So we'll see, I guess. Thank you for the follow. Um, Xstream10. We have a very warm... Uh, weekend here in Michigan. I hope that everybody is ready to sit inside in the air conditioning for the week. And that are in Michigan and wherever else it's hot. That follow animation is so perfect. Yeah, like you. Yeah, that was from uh, uh, Kegley. Kegley Antics. She had a uh, um, like a fundraiser. Um, Commissioned thing. She's pretty talented. If you don't know who that is, unfortunately, my bot isn't around, so it's hard for me to add extra like shout out stuff. But Kegley Antics, um, if you search the Kegley Antics on Mixer, yes, if you if you search for that on Mixer, um, I think she's I think she's a partner streamer now. Um, definitely check her out. There's only uh, one other person watching. Uh, that's possible. 
Uh, it's possible. As long as as long as cool people are here, that's all that matters. It doesn't matter how many people we have. Um, so this is going to be, I think, a double door. Um, here. And then we'll add in the slabs up top. I mean, earlier in the stream it was just me, so uh, we're already we're already ahead of of the game. <laughs> okay, um, so I think that's good. Uh, this no longer bugs me. Good. Good, good, good. So, is there a possibility I can join? No, nope. uh, this is actually this server is just for my patrons and I. Um, so it's a private server. Um, so that one. Okay. So I think what we can do, we have a little bit of time. Let's work on some of the other walls. Yeah. Sorry about that. Um, we might need more. We'll, we'll, we'll use these for now, and, and then we we'll might run out. We'll see. Nope. That's not my hacks. There we go. So you, it could still possibly fall off of here, but I'm gonna I guess I'll, I'll I'll assume that they won't, and if they do, it's, it's okay. They probably have feather falling boots. Um, so then. Coming around this way. Um, yeah, I, well, I usually, I haven't, uh, I don't have fallen in it. I've died uh, four times in the server. Um, I can't remember the causes. Probably analytics for that. Is it only, is it server, server wide or, let's see. Why, why have I died? Um, number of deaths, four. So that, that is, that is just this server. It looks like, and um, I'm just trying to scan this really quick to see if there's a indicator for why I've died. Probably died a total of, yeah. I mean, I I in my we play um, capture the monument, put the monument maps, um, and they I've died quite a bit in there. Um, Number of deaths. So possibly here, I've killed a lot of bats. Oh, okay, yeah. So this might tell me if I've died from mobs. Never died from any of those. I've died from oh slimes. Oh, that slime death where I lost all my stuff. Thank you for the follow, uh, Creeper Head Twenty Six. Yeah, so I've died from slimes twice. One of them I remember. I don't remember the other time. Um, stupid slimes. And then the other times must have been falling. Um, so might have been two deaths from falling, and then two deaths from slimes. So pretty safe. <laughs> Things have gone pretty well. So here's a little uh, balcony um, for this section here. So this is uh, where the main entrance to this back tower, and then we have a little balcony there, and then this I'll probably just leave open. Um, will I leave this whole room open, or will I have a room? I think I might have a room here. That would be three wide. Going across this way. Um, what's that? Which wall? Um, so I can go here. Let's put it here. Is that enough room? I think that's enough room to come by here. Maybe let's go one. Let's go in one more. So the room won't be as wide, but you gotta run. All right. Thank you for stopping by. X extreme. Extreme. I just got it. I just I just understood your your name. <laughs> um, so let's put uh, these across here, and I think that I'm actually gonna make this be a little bit wider here, just so there's a little bit more room. So I'm blocking off the whole thing. What I want to do is see, is this going to be one room or two small rooms? What's the space inside? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Aha, ten. So not not an, not an odd number. Well, that makes things difficult. Uh, so let's make one be, let's make one be three. And then we'll make the other one be um, four. That'd be fine. Um, what? 
It was, I guess the other one was three and this one's four. That's what it is. So we'll have that there. And then we'll come this way. So then this one's probably three. Is that what I did? No, they're both four. No, one's five, one's four. Oh, okay. That's five. Probably. Or I can make it be one big room and then we have the opening as a double door. I don't know what the room is going to be for anyway, so. Alright, we'll do this. Nope. Uh, big room with one door sounds good. Yeah, and then it's a double door because then it's even and everything's great. Um, Alright, so then that looks pretty good. Um, I'm going to still, once I get, I'm going to come back through and fix up the ceilings. Be a little bit better. Fix the lighting and stuff, like put torches on here and then try to eliminate stuff in here. So probably put like a something in there. Um, but we have a little bit more time. We'll work on this room now. So here, I want to have this accessible. I mean, I could have more secret, like redstone secret stuff in here. Um, oh, we need, do I have slabs? I do. Awesome. What I want to do is fix this up. This should be uh, a little wider. Skeleton there, said the wall. Okay, there we go. Um, so for the room in here, so we'll probably s start the room here. And then, so they can come over here and then that's, there's gonna be some sort of door there at some point. Um, so I might bring it over here. And then we'll close this up. So a single door, double door, <laughs> and double door there. And then this will leave open. Welcome, wizard, wizard jungle. Welcome. Um... This will be complicated. Because I can't do my usual stair thing here. Well, I could, I guess. But not here. So, maybe here we'll go like that. Uh, we'll come back to that. We'll see if that, if that bugs me later on after I finish off the rest of the ceiling and stuff. Um, okay. Padded room, that might be difficult to do in Minecraft. I guess it would have to just be snow. Lots of snow. Okay, so they come down here. Um, and then around the corner here. And then this is the main area here. We can close this up. Um, I might just leave this like this, just so I remember that if I want to have a secret tunnel or something there, I can do that. Um, oh yeah, sweet. Well, welcome. Um, so I think, oh no, good, we have some extra stone. Okay. So I'll have some sort of room over here. Um, I think that with this being here in the entryway, I might want to um, bring in a wall across the side here. Thank you very much, Wizard Jungle. Because it's the main, main entrance as you're coming into this room. Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't. I didn't line it up with that, but actually, that works better for in terms of like the ceiling thing. I was running a problem with in the, on the upper part. Um, so I think that we will do this. Although, then again, we're running on the same problem. But we could do this. That's fine. And then bring this wall over. So how many, how, how wide is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Whoa. So this room and the main one would, like, we'll make this one be an archway. Instead of being a single door, we'll put an archway that's three wide. I think it's in the middle. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. No, over one more. So here we will do 
this. And then we'll adjust the ceiling so that it lines up better after we come back in with some more stuff. Um, this we can go ahead and close up. And what's on the other side? Of the I think that's actually outside. Yeah. Oh, is that? Ooh, that's actually kind of nice. So this could be a secret door. If we're going to bring this wall in, we can have a secret door uh, coming this direction. So we'll go like that for now. So I will... Um, this is a secret space, and then I guess what I'll do is I'll put these in, just so I remember that I could go through there, possibly. Um, yeah, there's not very many circles. There's, like, you know, it's a close, as close as you get as to an archway. I think there's a ch chicken on the side of this. Okay, that's good. How are we, okay, a little bit more time. So let's go next floor down. So this room, we'll have to deal with these at some point. But this is a much larger space, so we could make a hallway going down the middle, possibly. Um, or maybe it comes this direction, and then we go... So we have no windows we have to worry about. We could potentially put in a railing here, if this is going to be a walkway. Um, you thought this was Magic the Gathering? Magic, Magic the Gathering is pretty cool. Uh, we'll come this way. Uh, okay, we're low, but we're in luck. Because there's a bunch of blocks in here. <laughs> How convenient. So we can put this in. Oops. We'll leave the, that chest in the middle. So then this is going to come this direction. Uh, how wide is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Thank you for the follow, uh, Zenga, EG, I think. So we can have a door here. So then we'll bring a wall this direction. And then we'll close this up. So again, if we wanted to have a secret space, this is going into the earth. Um, so this could look at, link up to something. There's going to be sewer systems running all the way through here. So this could potentially somehow link up to the sewers, maybe. But for now, we'll just leave that open. And we'll close this up. This wall is going to come this direction. So here will be a spot where it could be a secret door. Maybe. Um, through here, and then this room here is going to come across I think just like that. Although I guess there's a lot of space here, but maybe we'll do something in, over here, like there'll be a table or something. Um, and so this room will go like that. And close this up. And then again over here, this one could come through. And have a secret door here. Hello, uh, Walnut Daisy. Welcome. Uh, okay, so then here, we'll have to work on how that how that's going to work with the ceiling. I guess we could we could actually end this room a little earlier, and then make put a secret something here. So this could be a secret door instead, which comes into this space. So a couple of different secret doors that lead into you know, whatever's over here. So that could somehow hook up to something. So we'll mark those as secret doors. Welcome, A-T-I-4-P-P-O, four, four four, four T-P-O, like the C-3-P-O, but four instead. A secret door off of a secret door. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, so it's like in these two rooms, whatever they are, there'll be two secret doors that run, that can hook into the sewer system or whatever. I have to, I have to plan that out still, that part of it, but... I'm losing my voice. <laughs> so I think, thank you for the follow, uh, Puppet564, welcome. Um, this will actually be the end of the stream today. Uh, losing my voice, and I have to go back to work. Uh, thank you everybody for stopping by.